hey guys so it's friday i just ended a great work day and i just dropped off the girls at the airport um we're gonna be visiting honolulu this weekend i'm catching my flight tomorrow and i decided that today would be the best day to give a tour of the airbnb show you where we're staying um and see how i'm living for the next month in hawaii i'm really excited right now i'm upstairs on my patio but i'm gonna start from downstairs and just work my way up so Keep watching if you want to see more of the house and maybe I can even show you a little bit more throughout the resort. These are the beautiful steps I get to walk up into. We have some garden area. And I love this so much, so beautiful. It's a little dark in here, but when you first walk in, there's this cute little rug. These are the stairs that lead to upstairs. It came with a washer and dryer. Kind of happy I'm remembering this because I need to get some stuff out of there. Down here we have the bathroom next to the bedroom of one of the guests that are staying here with me. We all work at the same company. What's up? And this is our beautiful kitchen. I love how big it is so we all have space. Like there's bar stools and everything like that. Um, we have enough room in the refrigerator as well. They gave us tons to work with in the drawers, so I'm really grateful for that. All the pots and pans and just different appliances. Um, that's our little dining area. Here's the living room. So on Tuesdays, we all like to come down here and watch The Bachelor together. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty nice. I love sitting down here and just chatting with everyone. I'll show you outside. I love our downstairs patio so much. So we have a little sink with just some little drawers, some other places, a grill. This is what our seating looks like. Love that. Some more seating. And this is what we get to see in the mornings. It's not super duper sunny today, but behind, these are lava rocks and behind those, is the golf course so it's pretty cool just to watch people play golf early in the day hear all their joy and excitement <laughs> when they hit a hole so yeah i guess i'll take you back inside so you can see the upstairs up the stairs we go here's a view from up here through the blinds i'll give you a tour of my room we have a little area out here so there's a printer. We have a nice little thermostat to mess around with. Um, and then I love having the desk here for people to work. Cute little couch. And this is my room. Um, here's a dresser with a TV. I've been here almost two weeks, still have not turned the TV on. I ordered a phone tripod off Amazon to take pictures because I was able to sit, fit it in my suitcase when I first came. A fan, I have a patio area I'll show in a minute. And here's my bed with a little headboard. I sleep with the extra blanket because I get cold at night. Here's my desk area where I like to work. There's plenty of cords everywhere. My snacks, I always have my snacks with some water, some things for my camera, snacks. Um, and then I have my work computer, which is my Surface, and then just my personal laptop, which is my Mac. So, here is the bathroom. Love the tub, so beautiful. I'm not a huge bath person, but I'm gonna make myself take a bath while I'm here. Here's the shower. I love it. Oh, it's so pretty. And then here is my closet. So yeah, I have plenty of space. I mean, I'm not here that long, so I don't have a ton of clothes, but I also have some clothes in my drawer. But here's my sink, and then I have plenty of stuff in these drawers. So like makeup, my body stuff, jewelry, tons of masks. And you're probably wondering, where's the toilet? Here's the toilet room. And I walk back out, show my Patio. I love sitting out here to work or just hanging out and so beautiful. Just love to watch the sunrise in the morning and I love it. 
the people have been super nice, super genuine, and they've made this experience even better for me um, by giving suggestions of where to go and things like that. So I'll continue to just keep making different snippets of the places I'm at and the things I'm doing here in Hawaii. A lot of this is new for me, so hopefully I can keep showing more and I'm super excited to see what's gonna happen over the next two to three weeks here. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> it's Wednesday and I'm gonna take you along with me on my work from home routine while I'm here in Hawaii. It's a little bit different than at home. I start way earlier. So it's about 6 a.m. here and I'm about to wash my face, brush my teeth, um, start my day. I have a big presentation day. So I'm gonna be practicing a little bit before that. It's about two and a half hours from now and yeah. I'll just take you along with me and show you what I do today. I just hopped in the car and I made a very last minute decision to go get Starbucks. Um, I have a big presentation today and I want to start off my morning right with some good breakfast. I don't really have too much at the house. I got a pink drink and I got a bacon and gouda breakfast sandwich. So yeah, I have a little extra time. It's not too far away from the house and I think it'll be nice just to get a little little treat before I get the prize later on after killing this presentation. bacon gouda sandwich here we go and my pink drink light ice they put too much ice in the drinks it's like half the drink is gone so time to head back to home Okay, so I just did a run through. I hit about nine minutes. Uh, my goal is to hit near 10. So I already know I'm probably gonna speak a little bit faster than I want to, but I always still try to slow down by taking some pauses, some deep breaths, um, asking if there are any questions after each slide. So I'm gonna do about two more run throughs before the presentation. It's in like 45 minutes. So I still have some time. I feel pretty confident. It's a project I've been working on since October. So it's, it's been some months. It's been some months. And I think this is my time to really showcase how am I contributing on this team and why am I a valuable person and really making sure that they understand how this project is impactful for their future decision making when we do this launch um, for digital stores. So I'm pretty excited. I'm just ready to get it over with. It's one of those things, that it's just sitting on your shoulders, you're ready to get it done. So I'll check in afterwards, but I just threw on this little button, on, button up that I had so I can look presentable on camera. I have on some sweatpants, but it's fine, nobody can see that, but yeah. today I killed it they said thank you did such a good job of explaining we don't have too many questions baby I know because I was prepared I was prepared oh so good so good so good today's a good day I'm done I'm done <laughs> logging off <laughs> sorry I'm just like so overjoyed because this has been on my shoulders for so long and I finally got to share with them what I've been working on and how it's impactful to them and it relates to everything that they're doing. Too good to be true, too good to be true. So I'm very energized today. I'm just gonna knock out the rest of my plate, emails, checking in. Um, I have a one-on-one -on -one today with someone I met on LinkedIn. So super excited, <laughs> just so happy.
with my work day and I'm about to go take a nap. <laughs> um, it's probably like 5.45 back at the office. So I pretty much wrapped up everything I need to do today. It was a good day, I feel accomplished. And I'm gonna go chill, maybe redo my hair a little bit and get ready for tonight because one of the girls here, it's her birthday and we're going to a nice place for dinner. So pretty fancy, pretty excited and we'll see what the food tastes like. Here's the dress. Isn't she a cutie patootie? Yeah. Yeah. So, I'm gonna take my hair down. And baby, she, these hairs lay down. Yes. Okay, so it's time to take my hair down. Now I gotta put on my lips. We'll be ready to go. super nice it's probably one of the best restaurants i've been to ever it's called canoe house and it was kind of a hard decision but i decided to move forward with the five course meal so the oysters should be coming out soon yes they also yes look at the bread you know what it is yes oh it smells so good <laughs> Course number two. Let's see. Guys, I won't lie to you. Don't know what this is, but looks pretty yummy. I'm excited to try it. Let's dive in. Okay, we are on course three now. So here is what we have. It's also Mahi Mahi for the Mahi menu. Just a different preparation with the mushroom and Okay, awesome. So this is a Mahi Mahi with some mushroom. Mushroom is one of my favorite vegetables, so. Okay, I'm gonna take a bite of the uh, Mahi Mahi. Let's see, ooh. Good. Ooh, so good. Mm. Can't beat it, can't beat it. All right, so we have made it to course four, and it's a beef tenderloin with some vegetables. I forget what seasoning he says on top, but it looks really pretty. So I'll go ahead and give you another preview again. Focus in. Here we go. Look at that. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up with my fork some, so you guys can see the inside. Let's. Ooh, yes. You already know. All right, so let's go ahead and dive into this one and then you'll see dessert next. Okay, so we have made it to the end and we're finally at the fifth course, which is the dessert. I'm gonna give you a peek. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what it is. I think it's like strawberry, guava, coconut, mixed with some other stuff, but this is what it looks like. I can't really explain this. It looks good though. Mm. The fruit is so good. Okay. Dinner was 